the pastor was talking and okay <laughs> i'm not understanding like what is going on like there was no ghanaian accent like someone will not be giving me some eyes like this at this point guys i was like what is this Hello, blessed. Welcome back to another vlog. Yeah, 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 yeah. Guys, as you can see, I'm not home. I'm out. And <laughs> it's very early in the morning. Like, this is quite early. Hence, my voice is like this. And you can see from my eyes, it's like it's a bit red. I don't know if you guys can see. But I just want to talk to you guys. Like, yeah, it's quiet. Yeah, it's cool. Before it gets busy. So, guys. I was invited for a baby dedication by a very, 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 very sweet friend of mine. Like, she's also a YouTuber here on YouTube. Please, guys, do check her out. Her channel's name is Messi Enyoha. I'll be leaving it on the screen. She has been there for me since day one, like since day one. And so she invited me for a baby's dedication. And also, I've never seen her before. We only just talk on phone and all that. Anyway. When she invited me for a baby adoring, baby dedication and all that, I don't know if this is my week is even placed to wear. I beg. Charlie, it's early morning. You guys should just <laughs> pardon the way I look like no makeup. Like just pardon your girl. So guys, she also told me that, you know, a pastor and a wife, they are Ghanaians. I was like, wow, that's interesting. Anyway, unfortunately, we kind of arrived like late. But something interesting happened. When she told me, like, the pastor and, you know, the wife are Ghanaians, I just assumed maybe there will be more Ghanaians in the church. So I'll be coming to, you know, just, you know, dance to some Ghanaian Christian music and all that. It's not like I don't like Nigerian music. Oh, don't come for me. Uh -huh. Just like, I miss that vibe. So I was kind of anticipating to, you know, just dancing to Ghanaian music, getting, you know, a mix of both Ghana and Nigerian music, like, in a go. <laughs> Who doesn't want that because she already stated that there are nigerians in her church but i just assumed there'll be more ghanaians because the pastor is a ghanaian like just my assumption anyway guys I actually had to stand like i don't know sitting down was a bit uncomfortable yeah so on getting there i was just hearing you know nigerian music they are just dancing english ah, the feel the vibe was just a nigerian church i was like okay I'm not understanding, like, Ghana for what is going on? Like, what is going on? What is going on? Anyway, to cut the long story short, the pastor was talking, and it took me a minute to even know he was the pastor because I don't really know him by face. Like, there was no Ghanaian accent, like, no bashing, yeah, but there was no Ghanaian accent. I was like, okay, because most times when a Ghanaian is talking, I just know. The same way, like, we Nigerians, when we are talking, like you just know yeah so i didn't really get that you know that feel anyway after the whole church service we went for the reception i met my friend we we're excited to see each other we all like you guys to see the whole video about all that but another interesting thing happened so the few years i've spent in germany like i've attended parties like you know baby dedication birthday parties like just name it yeah and guys <coughs> Oh, uh, things they happen like things they happen some of the attitude you will get at those parties especially when it comes to the time of you know food and all that guys it can be so so annoying so guys because of all this attitude and all that when it comes to like you know food when i just go to a party i just respect myself like i respect myself well, well. i will just sit at my corner <coughs> i don't want someone to come and give it to me <coughs> someone will not be giving me some eyes like this or someone will not be, you know, throwing some words to me, directly or indirectly. Like, guys, I've seen a lot. But at this party, the vibes was just different. Everybody was friendly. They were dancing. They were excited. There was no attitude coming from anywhere. Even when I went to take food, because I had to go and take food for my daughter first. Like, they were so nice. They were just smiling. Like, what do you want? I like this. I was like, ah, 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 ah. okay. Mm, this is the beginning. And the second time I went to take my own food, the party was, you know, serve yourself. But the servers were just, you know, there to just direct things, make sure everything is going in order. So when I got there, they were all smiling and all that. I was like, okay. Hmm. Hmm. 
<laughs> can this be real like can this be real so for the third time i have to go back to take for my mom because my mom was busy with you know taking care of my daughter and at this time i felt like they are going to give it to me because <laughs> i've been there the first time to take for my daughter the second time to take my own and now the third time to take for my mom and if you have attended a real 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 nigerian party when they start seeing your face like repeatedly <laughs> like guys just thinking of how they will give it to you is making me laugh because when they start seeing your face repeatedly just know that <clears throat> you want to receive like you just want to receive so i was already having like you know shaky feet and all that but to my shocking surprise i've been a surprise shocking anyone you call it the lady was just all smiling and all that and i was like oh i want to take for my mom like she can't come herself i was just giving a long story she wasn't even like you know interested to you know if i was to pick for myself again or my mom like it was like oh just take like ah serve yourself like you know just serve yourself i was like okay after serving myself and all that guys she was like are you sure that's enough ah don't you want more da -da 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 -da. <laughs> <laughs> at this point guys i was like what is this <clears throat> i've never seen this before like i have never seen this kind of warm reception in a party before i was very surprised i was very shocked so we all had a nice time there was no kind of attitude that i said and everything come and see the Ghanaians in the church like they were dancing to nigerian music having fun celebrating eating nigerian meal they were so excited like you can't even tell the difference that this is a Ghanaian, this is a nigeria you can't tell all of them were just you know so united happy celebrating guys so i know that nigerians and Ghanaians, <laughs> we have love between ourselves like no doubt but this amount of love that i saw at this party <laughs> it was something else like something else the cooperation the love the unity everything was top notch i had to call my friend after the party i said please like just give me the gist mm -mm, this is your church like how do you guys do it actually yes i could be points on Ghanaians, but i really had to know like is your church mostly nigerians or you know are they Ghanaians? she was like oh yeah they are nigerians and they are Ghanaians, like in the church but nigerians are kind of a bit more than the Ghanaians, but both Ghanaians and Nigerians and the church. And you can't even tell because they both dance to, you know, Nigerian music, they vibe and everything. Even the pastor. <laughs> the pastor, you will not even know that. <laughs> oh, you will not know that. Like, you will not know. Everything is just so united, beautiful. Like, the atmosphere, everything is just so, so peaceful. I was just so happy seeing that. It brought a lot of joy to my heart. Just seeing the love between these two countries and just seeing how much they just, you know, look beyond any kind of rift or anything. And they are just, you know, showcasing love, like pure, undiluted love for each other. And I don't want to use this medium to tell you that wherever you are, just preach love. Let's leave others banter, others issues, others things. Like, it won't take us anywhere. There is this air of peace, love, like, you just feel it where there is unity. There is love there is peace there is joy so guys i just had to drop this here because i really enjoyed myself i really love the atmosphere and i just want to say please 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 let us all you know emulate this and let's keep preaching peace love and unity so i will allow you guys watch the video like just enjoy the video sit back relax don't go anywhere and enjoy this beautiful video and please don't forget to check out my friend mercy and your heart like when you go there <coughs> you enjoy yourself she has beautiful lovely family to enjoy yourself and she also have videos with her pastor like i am begging you guys please check her out thank you very much so guys much. this is what i'm wearing yeah i'm just wearing this white lace I don't know if you guys can see, yeah. Guys, we're on our way to the world, adoring. Is that how they call it? Yeah, adoring. Osby is not taking us anyway. He's just going to drop us at the train station. Then we'll find our way. He has something to do. So I'm going with mom C and baby girl. She's at the back there. Amy, baby. Mm. She's not in the mood.
talk to me nice Talk to me honestly Look in my eyes Let it flourish our body in the mighty name of Jesus We give you thanks We give you thanks We give you praise Remember that Remember that Glory be to your name In Jesus mighty name Amen